Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. What's up, beautiful people? Today is gonna be a family affair. Today is actually Saturday, so we're about to do some family fun. We're gonna go to the mall. The kids are back on their iPads. That's what we do. I already showed y'all breakfast. If you missed breakfast, here's a short clip of what breakfast looked like. And actually, the beef bacon was actually good. It had like a, a moist um, beef jerky type vibe, like a moist beef jerky. That's what I would say it as. Like, that was my first time ever seeing it and eating beef bacon. But nonetheless, we're going to go have some fun. I'm going to take y'all along the way and we'll talk about the sights and the scenes that are to be seen while out in Johannesburg. Let's go! What's up, beautiful people, and welcome to another episode of Don't Keep Up With, Don't Keep, Don't Keep Up With The Joneses. Don't, don't keep up with the, don't keep up with the Joneses. Don't keep up with, don't keep, don't keep up with the Joneses. Don't, don't keep up with the, don't keep up with the Joneses. So on Friday, Crystal and I went to this chicken spot. I believe it's called Natto's. Y'all can correct me in the comments. But anyway, this is what we had. I had the chips and the rice and the chicken crystal had the chicken wrap she had rice and some roasted vegetables and it also came with bread so this was a nice 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 lunch and again the prices are not bad eleven dollars and ten cents you can't get that back at home nowhere and then we went to the store and look at these dove like q-tips like wait a minute i'm used to dove soap but they have dove q-tips i just couldn't do it i couldn't i couldn't figure it out but here we are, ladies and gentlemen, on our way to the mall, uh, City Center, Nelson Mandela Square, or Sun City, I believe is what it's called. But even the Uber driver, he was like, hey, can you make the change? Because we did ask to go to Nelson Mandela Square, but then we were like, no, we don't like the air, like dropping off right there. We want to go to the mall. Side note, look at this building. Where do you find architecture like this in the States? I'll wait. But nonetheless, here are some other buildings and then making a change to the city towers is what we did with the Uber. But as you saw, they're still even building. But look at the beautiful, magnificent architecture, infrastructure, streets, decor, the trees in the center, like coming out the concrete. Like It's just beautiful. It's beautiful. And things like this, I don't want to take for granted. However, I wanted to show it to you all. There's the Radisson Blue which is in Santa, and a lot of people do stay there because it is close to the mall. I wouldn't say it's walking distance, but there's the train station actually to the right, which will get you to and from the airport. We take that quite a bit to the point where it, it gets you from there to the airport in ten, for $10. I know that by heart. Maybe $11, $11. But um, all that to say, look at the buildings. Look at what you see. Look at what it has to offer. This, ladies and gentlemen, is Santa, Johannesburg, South Africa. Again, the things that you don't see on TV too often. However, the true and the real of what's taking place here in South Africa. And so if this is somewhere that you believe that you want to be, this is where you will find yourself. And uh, here we are coming up on the mall itself. And so Da Vinci, that's a very popular hotel, which if you do stay there, you will be very connected to the mall, actually connected to the mall. And so it's uber um, convenient. And so nonetheless, here we are. We're about to get off here, going to Santa City to the left, the mall, and then Mandela was to the right. This girl is on fire. No. Um, Barbie? Guess what I see? This girl's on fire. Look, kiss by kiss. What kind of kiss by kiss? <laughs> Daddy, now it's your turn again. All right, come on. Look at this piano. I know you was going for it too.
Rain wanted this opportunity to walk around in the store with the shopping cart that's her size and do some shopping. And so she had a little fun doing that. Her hair looks nice. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even realize that. But, our, uh, yeah, this is Rain's fashion as well. Uh, she put this outfit together herself. She loves doing that. It was music playing, so that's why it's muted. Didn't want any copyright scenarios. But, again, this toy store was amazing. Uh, amazing. I forgot the name of it. It was on the slide. Go back and look at it. But it had everything a child would want. And, you know, this might be the, the go-to spot for the Christmas time frame. We'll see. We'll see. And, uh, yeah, she's doing shopping things but then they even had this fun play area it was like three play areas that they had for the kids this is a fully functional water play area that ricky had a ball at like he could have stayed there for at least 50 minutes but 10 minutes is all he had because i wasn't gonna stand right there all day but he absolutely loved it rain did too she went off to go do another thing at another play area and so yep here we have McDonald's. Great people to some and maybe like, oh my gosh, why are you at McDonald's? To us, it's like, you know, it's a little taste of home, a little bit. And the kids loved it. They really was wanting McDonald's. So, you know, parents do what the kids want. And we got them McDonald's. They had these chicken strips that I had, which were absolutely amazing. I would do the chicken strips again. Y'all know I'm a chicken man. And so, but the sauces you have to pay for. Sweet and chili, get it, get it, get it. Here we are at church, great people, on Sunday, getting our church in. Y'all know we do the church. This is the second service at Rivers Church, Santon, and that was a magnificent service. Here's the praise and worship. It was doing everything it needed to do. The song was You Are More Than Able, and man, it was rocking here. You can see the people all at the top now. At the beginning, it was the beginning of service, and it starts to fill up. Ricky had an award for being the praiser of the day or something like that. Here we are eating, and this right here, it gets me every time. I love those chicken patties that they have. Absolutely amazing. Only 29 ran for two. And then I also picked up this cookie, which I know was cookie, I must say. Um, it, it wasn't. It wasn't what I wanted it to be. But, um, you know, it's all to the good. There's my lovely wife. She picked up a piece of cake, some water, and some other things. She happy about her cake. The kids loved it. Rain always looking Rain always looking rainish. You know what I'm saying? You got to watch that girl. But here's that food court area. I love this church. It's awesome. We actually doubled down. We doubled down on church. This was the five o'clock evening service that we attended. Uh, first time going to the evening service. However, they had guest speakers from Texas. And so we were like, oh, man, we should go back. They, The wife preached a phenomenal word at the 11 o'clock service. And the husband had the five o'clock service. And they did a fab tablet job. And look at this, like this song was rocking. The lights were rocking. It was a, it was a fun time. I didn't really know the song, but after it played a little bit, I started to pick it up. And I was like, man, I want people to be able to experience a snippet of what praise and worship was like during the five o'clock service. So it's like nice, edgy and for the youth. I will say that like young adults, y'all will love that service. Here we are driving back. Uh, this is Santon at night and it's just a vibe. It's a vibe that I believe, obviously, you should see, which is why I captured it. However, nighttime, you know, nighttime. And McDonald's is here as well. It says it's 24 hours. I don't know. I haven't tried it, so don't hold me to it or even them to it. But nonetheless, it's just Santon at night, great people. You have to love it. And we'll see you on the next vlog. Stay tuned.